Something we're often asked for in an operation is a swab on a stick. We would usually use a 10x10 10 10 Ratex swab for this. Certainly it must be actually detectable no matter what you use, but it could be a swab of any size. Most often you would put this on a Rampley sponge holding forcep. A Rampley sponge holder is basically an artery forcep that we use for holding sponges for prepping patients, but we can use them for holding swabs inside to dab small things. So, I favour my left hand. It makes absolutely no difference which way you do this. These instruments are in fact right-handed, so you can do it either way. I'll show you both. So I've already counted my five swabs with my floor nurse. One, two, three, four, five. And then I'm going to take one of my swabs and put it on a stick. Now, I'm going to flip it over so the extra strip is pointing downwards. I'm going to lift the bottom corner up nearly to the middle of the swab, and this is just for neatness. I'll lay my open rampley on the swab. This corner I'm lifting over the right side. I'm going to lift the left side and tuck it under. That's it now secured. The left side comes over and into the middle. Now I've got nothing to secure it so I have to hold it with my fingers and this is where it gets a little bit fiddly because I have to now get the top corner into the middle also. So I tend to swap and pop my thumb there just to hold it in. I'm going to catch this bit and bring it into the middle also. My instrument is still open, you'll see. I'm going to push them down into the middle and I'm going to shut the instrument and not try and shut my fingers in at the same time. As the instrument closes, you can extract your fingers and lock the ratchet. Now you can see, if I turn it over, you can see my x-ray strip. I've got a nice neat swab and it can be used for dabbing perhaps deep down in an abdomen or in a joint. By having this stripe here, when you go to recheck your swabs at your next closure, you can very plainly see one, two, three, four and five. So you don't have to take it off to show your floor nurse that it is in fact one. So I'll show you one more time. I'll do it the other way this time. So I actually strip is pointing downwards. Instrument open in my right hand. I'm going to lift the bottom corner to the middle and lay the open instrument on it. I'm going to bring the left side over and tuck it under the right, the right side over and into the middle, swap so my thumb is holding it all in so I can pick this bit up easily, whichever way works for you really. I'm going to tuck it all into the middle of the instrument while squeezing the instrument shut and shutting the ratchet. So here we have my extra strip again on the front, a nice tight swab which can be used for dabbing. And again, when you come to do your check, one, two, three, four and five. This means that if at the start of the case you needed to mount two swabs on the sticks, it's very easy to account for all your swabs during the case.